Hey guys, Danman here, and thanks for stopping by. Today we're going to be taking a look at Quinn, and if you stick around to the end, you'll find out Quinn, you should use her. Yeah, that just happened, so let's do this. So let's start out with the good, and let me tell you straight off, there are a lot of good things about Quinn. First, her range is incredible. The longest range used to belong to Voka, but with Quinn stepping into the Tower Heroes Arena, she has now taken that crown as highest ranged hero at 27 versus Voka at 25. Next, let's talk about her damage. Once again, this is really good. On my standard test alien, she does 2730 damage, and with a max hero count of 6, her max damage output with all heroes is 16380. This is outstanding damage output, ranking her among the top 10 outputters in the game. You add on top of that her special ability, which is to slow enemies for 10 seconds, and she becomes one of the best overall heroes in the game, in my opinion. Imagine having Spectre, Balloon Pal, Six Quins, and it, any other hero, really. Quinn slows down all the enemies on the map because of her special ability and incredible range with the Balloon Pal. You pop Spectre and just melt enemies and bosses. Next, her mana cost is very low considering how much damage she does. Mana per one damage is a stat I like to use to show how much mana it costs to get one point of damage with a hero when they are maxed out. Quinn sits at 6.47 mana per one damage, which for a ranged hero is amazing. The best in fact, beating Scientist, Bebo, and Sparks hands down. So not only does she have high range and damage, but she's also very mana efficient in achieving that high damage output. Once again, best in class. So let's go over what she's good at again. Best range damage in the game, excluding boosted wizard. I have a video on wizard showing that in theory, they're the highest DPS for ranged, but in reality, it's extremely hard to get and not worth it at all, in my opinion. Check out that video if you'd like. It's in the upper right hand corner now. Quinn also has the best mana efficiency for all ranged and almost the lowest max hero count at 6 versus scientist at 5. Ranking her the best overall ranged hero in my opinion and top 4 overall best damage in the game. But of course, with the good, there has to be something about her that isn't great. And that is true, her rate of fire is very low. So faster moving targets like a stream of ghosts or spiders at the start of a map might be difficult for her to handle. Other than that, the good far outweighs the bad. So I'd like to give a few tips on how to use Quinn. First, if you haven't seen my ranged DPS guide, I made it before Quinn was available, but it 100% applies to her. So if you want to check that video out after this one, I'll leave a link to it in the description. The point is to make sure that you don't put her too close to where the enemies come out. She has huge range, so don't waste it. Put her in the middle of the map and use that range to its fullest and she will just slap. Next, she really starts to shine with a balloon pal next to her. So drop one early and let that range really reach out and touch someone. Her huge range will make up for her slow fire rate against high health enemies and let other heroes worry about those fast movers. She does get detection at level two, but this really isn't her job. She's a heavy hitter, not a fast rate of fire hero. Lastly, I want to give a shout out to Zanman and Supergirl. They actually both got Quinn before I did and told me how great she was. And I was super pumped to test her out once they told me that. And they were absolutely right. So, should you be using her in your deck? Absolutely, no question. Buy her and put her in your deck now. Who should you remove to put her in? Well, that's a tougher question. Uh, if you're solo, I'd probably put her in place of Scientist for the single target damage. However, if you see my video in the background on Castletown, I replaced Branch instead because this map is a high single target damage. If I was on Reef or any other high density enemy map, I'd keep Branch and replace Scientist. If it were a high DPS map, I'd probably go Yasuki Quinn. <laughs> oh my goodness, just thinking about that now. Yasuki, Quinn, Spectre, Balloon Pal. I mean, seriously powerful combo right there. That actually will probably become my favorite deck real quick. All right, if you liked what you saw here, be sure to like and subscribe to support the channel. And that wraps it up for me today. I hope you enjoyed this video on Quinn and thanks for stopping by. Out.